Hey, it's Harry here with SMB Nation, and I'm with Steve Young from an old, old, old friend called Untangle. And I'm going to give some context on that, but thanks for stopping by. We're at the CompTIA Channel Con Conference 2019 at the Bellagio uh, in Las Vegas, of course. And uh, this is always a fun conference because you can see everybody at one place at one time. You don't have to go to three or four conferences. Right. But, um, folks, to give you some context, we did some work with Untangle back, I, I like to say, before the Great Recession hit. And what was interesting about that, uh, first of all, the times were good, but yeah. more importantly, you were having an open source based conversation in our community, and our community derives from Microsoft's small business mm -hmm. server, right? So we would have been thinking about, I think ISA was still around back then. I mean, we, we would have been thinking about Microsoft type yep. security solutions. Yep. And so then you guys come along and you opened our eyes, because again, Seattle, Microsoft, SMB Nation, we normally wouldn't uh, wake up thinking open source and that kind of thing. Yeah. So why don't you reintroduce your company? Yeah. Uh, what is your product? What do you do? And, and, and basically, what's your story? Yeah, uh, thanks a lot, Harry. Um, one thing that most people don't realize is we've been around since 2003. Yeah. You know, yeah. we've been around for a very long time. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, it's crazy. But uh, people are always like, you know, are you guys new? And we're like, no, we've been around. Yeah. <laughs> um, but it's been more, like you said, we're, we were open source and uh, people kind of knew us kind of from the open source community, the Linux community. Right. Um, we're still Linux Debian based. Yeah, that, yeah. So um, we it's are- It's come a long way. I mean, the, the attitudes have changed over yeah. 10 years. Yeah, over t yeah <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> Um, we are mostly still open source. We're kind of a freemium product, um, but for us, it's uh, still the same mission. We're still trying to help uh, you know, SMBs with their network security and yeah. trying to make sure that uh, they have the easiest to use, easiest to deploy product and at the price point that they're comfortable with. Yeah. Um, and so for us, you know, that same mission has been you know the lifeblood of Untangle for 16 years. Yeah, and 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 now it's all coming back to me. So back in the day, I recall your basic product was free, and in fact, I think I played with it in one of my SBS books as a, an aside. And you made your money from product support yeah. uh, back in the day. What what is your business model today? Uh, so we're no longer just free. Um, <laughs> we actually so Fair enough. <laughs> yeah we we have a few free apps still. Yeah. Um, and that's just for you know the people who are looking for the very very basic basic protections. Uh, but really for the SMBs we definitely yeah. recommend our complete packages. Uh, we still make it very easy for people to utilize that and we include everything um, in under one price. Yep. So that includes support. That includes our new centralized cloud management system called Command Center. We launched that about two years ago, so you might not have heard about no, that. No, no, I, I, yeah. and forgive me, I haven't. I mean, yeah. I, I, that's why we're talking. We're <laughs> reintroducing ourselves, <Yeah>. sir. <laughs> yeah. um, and so Command Center has really made it uh, very viable for MSPs to start using us from a very centralized cloud managed service. Yeah. And it's free with all of our complete packages. Um, and we, we have some partners that you, you know utilize that to manage two to 300 different appliances from one single pane of glass yep. and so we really have come a long way since those days and um, we still have some free features but for the most part now we're mostly a freemium product well yeah and fair enough um, last question uh, one of the coverage areas here at the CompTIA Channel Con conference and and, and and for whatever reason just in general is uh, the verticals. so can you point to verticals where you play well healthcare yeah. what, what are your verticals well the two biggest ones for us is actually government and actually uh, education. Education ah. is ah. probably one of our largest verticals, mostly because uh, schools love the fact that you can create rule-based um, filtering and things like that. So things like administration level filtering, sure. Sure. Uh, teacher level filtering, and then student access policies, uh, blocking all the you know porn and those kinds of like yeah, access yeah, things, no. uh, and making sure people just have the credentials that they need. And then from the government standpoint, um, we have a lot of things that you know from uh, traffic shaping, landfill over balancing, yeah. uh, those things that are kind of infrastructure critical kind of things we have. So they love us for that. Yeah, and uh, I, I guess I do have one more final question is, um, do, do you still have the green Jeep? You had a big Jeep, <laughs> Hummer, whatever. You used to go to the, uh, the, the Apple Mac world. I yeah. saw you guys there. 
<laughs> so there's a famous photo in our office uh, with Dirk Morris, our founder and chief product officer, uh, with in front of the uh, that green yeah, Jeep. Dirk. Yeah, that's yeah, his yeah, name. that's yeah. his name. Yeah, and he's uh, still around. He's still around. He's okay. uh, he's uh, still kicking. Okay. Um, but yeah, so that Jeep actually has no longer with us, but it's lived in infamy in our company <laughs> for a very long time. All right. Well, Steve, have a great show. Yeah, Thanks thank for your you. time. All yeah, right. Thank you.